Good morning guys. So I woke up this morning and walked outside and it is beautiful. It feels like summer. It's actually spring, but it feels like summer outside. It just seems like a shame to be to be stuck in the house. So I'm going to take the girls for a bit of a walk and we're going to go to a cafe and get some breakfast this morning, aren't we Zoe? And I'm going to bring some of your breakfast with me as well so that I can feed you too. So we just came down to a cafe to have breakfast. Dave is just off playing on the play equipment and we're just enjoying the sunshine, aren't we, So It is seriously a beautiful day today, but um, man, I don't know. Like, I, I just wanted to sit down and, and chat with you guys and just sort of be real about how things have been for the last like like eight weeks now like we've been just trying to be really positive for the vlog for you guys and just you know, we don't like putting negative stuff out there we don't want to be like complaining or anything like that on the videos because you know realistically we're just so blessed to, to be able to live such an amazing life where we get to just hang out with our family and make videos it's literally the dream job but um the last eight weeks now we've just been struggling with sickness like like every day has just been a real struggle and we've just been trying to push through trying to get better and like we get better for a couple of days and then you know we're we're back to square one all over again like last night Nikki was uh, vomiting all night like yesterday she was fine she was completely fine and then it hit maybe like 11 o'clock and then all of a sudden she just ran to the toilet and then that was her vomiting for, for, for ages um, and me like like for the last two weeks now I've had a migraine that just does not want to go away I just have this this constant ache all around here I've been to the doctor about it a few times and he just says that it's like a severe sinus infection but um, it's just constantly there like it sort of like dies down a little bit and then just comes back with a vengeance I've had migraines in the past but they've never lasted more than a few days and this one has been just two weeks straight now like it just all started with this uh, virus or flu or whatever that we got about eight weeks ago and we're just we, we can't shake it like the kids have been sick as well and we're just we're trying to do everything right you know like we've had two courses of antibiotics we're on multivitamins on vitamin b's on like we're taking everything guys we're trying to clean up our diet we've been eating healthy lots of water we've been trying to do a bit of exercise we're, we're doing everything everybody tells us to do uh, thank you very much yeah, see, drinking orange juice, fresh orange juice instead of uh, <laughs> instead of Coke. But hey, Amy, you having fun playing? Yeah. You want a little bit of my orange juice? Oh, you want a milkshake? I ordered a milkshake for her. She remembered. It's coming, Daddy. <laughs> it is coming. I promise. You be very patient. But yeah, we've just been, we've been really struggling. We haven't been ourselves in about eight weeks and we're just, we're ready to be ourselves again. So, you know, if, if you guys believe in prayer, we would definitely appreciate it. If you guys could just say a couple of prayers for us so that we can all get better and, and, and be back to normal because we're really, ready to be back to normal we don't want to be complaining on the vlogs every vlog about how we're sick or we don't want to be missing vlogs all the time because we're sick we just you know we just want to be back to our positive selves so ah you got your milkshake is it good how cool is this bib that i got for zoe it's wu-tang clan protect your neck which if you don't know is one of their songs so it's just like a nice little bit of irony because it's it's protecting her neck yeah. good job you know what guys let's balance a negative with a positive because i don't want to just put negativity out there have you guys noticed how chill zozo is with me at the moment she still is very very whingy with me when we're home alone together but i found when i take her out somewhere she's just so calm and relaxed and it's just really helping with our bonding time so we've been trying to spend a lot more time together outside be it going for walks going to cafes or just like hanging out in the backyard so this warm weather is not just great for us because we enjoy the warm weather it's great for us because it's it's really helping with my bonding time with zoe and it's definitely making us feel a lot closer, which is something that I'm really appreciative of because, you know, 
it, it does suck when she's crying all the time for me, so I'm really loving her being all nice and sweet and clingy and happy. Pop! Pick out your nose! Pop! Pick out your nose! Pop! Remember me to put it back? There we go, I'll put it back. I got your nose! I'll put it back. There we go. <laughs> is that funny? What's up guys? I know this is like super late me saying hi to everyone. It's like literally four o'clock. I never ever ever start the vlogs this late, but it's just one of those days. I think you did you tell them about Yeah, I was telling them about last night. <laughs> last night. About last night. But anyway, my water just spilled in my bag. Great. <laughs> it literally is one of those days, huh? <laughs> Seriously. So we're just heading into the city at the moment. Well, we're technically in the city. We've been stuck in traffic for quite a while now. Um, we're heading in to support the boys who are doing the burpee challenge. Um, we also mentioned like really last minute yesterday on Instagram that we were all as a family going to be doing like a little meet and greet as well. So I'm not expecting a lot of people will be there because we did it really last minute. Um, mm. But we're running a little bit late because of the traffic jam. So I'm a little bit, bit stressed. I'm hoping that nobody's like getting mad waiting. It's never bad coming into the city at this time. It is bad today, isn't it? It's not bad today. It's not? No. <laughs> All right, so we're just across the road now. We're half an hour late. So I feel really bad if, if anybody has been waiting around like, we did this all really last minute, so I'm guessing not a lot of people would have came, but um, yeah, feel bad. Hey guys, so we finally made it to Fed Square. We got some gorgeous girls here waiting for us. Hey everyone! <laughs> they came out to support the boys. How have they been doing? So this is Ava's new best friend, Amaya. She just won't stop hugging her. She thinks she's the cutest. <laughs> <laughs> it's a new bestie, Ava. Oh my god, it's so cute! So we're here with Sam and Ethan. How you going, bro? I, I can imagine, like, you've been here since 10 a.m. and it's like 5 now. Yeah, I can barely talk. <laughs> dude, <rough. laughs> dude. How, how many are you up to now? 5,000 each. 5,220. That's incredible. To be exact. Each. Each. Dude. 10,000 altogether. That's, that's amazing, man. Like, you're, you're killing it. And the fact that you, you're doing it for a good cause as well is what makes it more more powerful, more meaningful. Like, you know, we're rooting for you. you you're going to get through Thanks, this, bro. <laughs> I, know, I know it's tough, but you're going to get through it, man. We believe in you, bro. So that was cool. Thanks to everybody who came down and got to hang out with us and, and just have a real good chat. It's always fun to, to meet people who are watching the videos. And yeah, I'm like so proud of the guys. They're doing an amazing job. 5,000 burpees and it's only five o'clock. They're absolutely killing it. We got Phoebe and Rufa here as well. <laughs> These three all used to work together once upon a time. The old crew. So we're just gonna go in and get something to eat. It's such a nice night tonight. It is a nice night. You know, I'm fine. So Jamie's actually gone. I don't know where he went. I think he went to go find some sneakers or something. So I'm here with the girls. Want some water? Yeah. Alright. Water's coming. Okay. Anyways. Oh, this is going out of the wall. Ava's dancing. <laughs> they definitely look like they're having fun. Look at this kid over here posing with this shoe. <laughs> She's so excited. She said it's the biggest shoe in the whole wide world. <laughs> She's such a little poser. I'm actually uh, still super out of it with this migraine though. I took some Panadine Fort, so it's like the migraine is numb. Like I can feel the throbbing, but I can't really feel the pain, which is which is good. 
Ava's just chilling here. She's got a blanket on in the pram. Loving life. Have you ever been in the city at night before, Ava? I don't know if you have. dancing before she was getting right into it <laughs> yeah, the trainees were getting right into it so the boys are up to 6352 each 53 Where did Ava go? There she is! <laughs> Where's Ava? There she is! Oh, Zoe's awake. Where's Ava? Ava's missing! Oh no! Okay, we have a runaway toddler. We have a runaway toddler. Where are you going? Hey Ava, let me show you something. Do you see that big screen up there? The big TV up there? Did you know that this is where your daddy asked your mommy to marry him? You knew that? Hey, they've changed the screen. They didn't used to have a screen on the side. They used to just have the screen there. Hey Avi, if it wasn't for this place, you might not even exist. Isn't that crazy? She says I love this. What? She said I love this. <laughs> hey guys, so we're home now and I don't know what happened. Like I've had this migraine all day. But aside from the migraine, I was cool. And then the car ride home, I just started just feeling ill. Like, like I'm losing my voice. My throat just feels like sandpaper. And then we felt Zoe and all of a sudden Zoe is burning up as well. Like, I don't know what's going on with us guys. This, is, this has been like eight weeks now that we've just been battling this. Like, we haven't even been showing you guys how sick we've been. Like we've been trying to make videos as well as be sick and, and put out like positive content. You know, like not content with us, like whinging and complaining about being sick. But I'm just being real with you guys. Like, like these last eight weeks of, of being really sick has been a struggle. Um, I actually have a business trip that I'm going on next week, like to New Zealand that I'm, I'm so excited about. And I just, I really want to get better for that trip as well. I just want to get better in general. I want all of us to get better. Like it's just like we're better for like a day or two and then like it comes back with a vengeance. And we don't even really know what it is. Like every time we go to the doctor, they're just like, you've got a virus. It's just, I don't know, it's weird. Like we've never collectively as a family been sick like this before. So um, yeah, I think, I think we're gonna take a break from, from making videos for like a week might even be like a week and a half you might might not see us we'll, we'll probably try and keep you guys updated on instagram or whatever but we just need a break i know a lot of people are like a break from what you make youtube videos that's not even a job but um i mean i'm normally up to like 1 a.m sometimes 2 a.m like like finishing all the editing finishing all the business side the part of it that actually like makes youtube a business um and i'm definitely not complaining because it's what world's best job but um, yeah, there is a lot, lot that goes into it when you do everything yourself. And I just, I just feel like we need a little bit of a break for like a week, a week and a half. Um, you know, we still love making YouTube videos and we want to get back to feeling healthy and 
being able to like make really good YouTube videos for you guys and also for us as well because you know we get a great sense of satisfaction out of it as well but yeah I just wanted to let you guys know what's what's going on with us we don't even really know what's going on with us why we're so sick um but yeah just to let you know we we've, we've we've been struggling lately with our health and we just need like a week two weeks break just to try and like recharge we love you guys thanks for the support i know some of you guys are going to be like you guys are always sick blah 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 um and it is it's, it's annoying when you're sick and you've got people giving you a hard time about being sick because obviously it's not something that you can help me especially because i got chronic fatigue syndrome i've been sick for like 15 years with it but when the whole family is sick with something that's when you know that that's like it's it's not normal anyway yeah send us some love and prayers and support we would really appreciate it because yeah you know we love hearing from you guys we love your positivity it helps us out and yeah we'll be back soon mm -hmm.